Quite simply, it doesn't get any more pressure-packed than this. The decisive game at the Euros with everything on the line. Which country will be crowned champions of Europe? It's going to be fascinating finding out. Find out with us on EA TV. And this is the game we've all been waiting for. The final itself here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. I'm Derek Ray, sitting high above the halfway line. And next to me, ready to provide expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. This should be fiercely contested. It's England, and they take on Spain. Well, there's going to be some nerves out there for sure, but what... Kane! Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Who can he pick out? Might be closely marked, but the header nothing to write home about. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford is the keeper. Kieran Trippier starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Phil Foden plays with Bukayo Saka on the flanks. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. Chance to cross. And the referee has given it. It will be a penalty. Can they forge ahead? Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes, yellow card, no. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Got a short corner here. Well, if we're in the business of identifying potential match winners, we've got to look to Phil Foden. Stuart, what might we see from him in this game? Well, he's the most creative player on the field. Oh, Stuart, they could be in here. Well, nothing about that chip was very positive. Well, I'm not sure that was the right option. It's a really wasted chance. Well, as we know, Spain have a very rich pedigree when it comes to the European Championship. Winners in 1964, 2008 and... Can he put them in front? Oh, no, he's missed the opportunity. And they remain level. Well, he just lacked composure there, didn't he? They should be ahead now. Oh, genuine chance. happened he's missed it and what a glorious chance it was well it's a bad miss he really should score there but superb defending Gabby on a clear foul but the referee letting the play flow well, not giving the opposition a look in that strong play can they get themselves in front here oh there's the goal there's the opener how about that well here's the replay he's done well to get his head up pick out a teammate and the movement is good making for a comfortable finish it's a really great goal well the ball is moving again will there be a quick reply from england there needs to be Rodri, good tackle, take it away. And since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Carvajal. Ferran Torres. Wasteful from Spain.
position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Oya Sabal! Oh, a good diving save. Going short. Good challenge and a throw in coming up. And keeping it out. Who's going to get on the end of it? And the delivery lacked a bit of guile. Walker just couldn't keep it. Rodri. Marino. And a play for a Spain throw in. Nicely timed tackle. Rodri. Trent Alexander Arnold. England moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And this to level it. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Mikel Marino. And easily intercepted. Walker. Decent looking pass. Well read to put an end to that attack. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And a decent save. Full credit. Oh, he's beaten his opponent. Trippier. Oh, a smart stop. Delivering it. Could still be dangerous. And in the end, no damage done. A chance then for the respective managers to address their chance. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Real determination and the challenge. A throw in here. Carvajal. And that was a very fine read. Attacking possibilities for England. Kane. And he couldn't quite get himself back on side, Stuart. Well, as a player, you need to be able to change your mind. But he wasn't able to, and that's a poor pass. Poor pass. Foden. Wonderfully weighted pass. And offside, unfortunately. Gabby. The ball with Rodri. Rodri. Gabby. Promising sequence. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Kane. Good high press. 
Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Really annoying for them. Couldn't take advantage. Feet in these situations, it's brilliant goalkeeping. Rashford unable to hold it. Rashford. Under the full weight of the pressure. And given away. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And a fine cross. Well, an audacious effort. Not every player would try that type of thing. Well, they've decided to make a change. Laporte. It's with Mikel Marino. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Gabi. And the emphasis is on creativity. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Gabi. Lenormand. Here's Carvajal. Danny Olmo. The attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. And passing it through, and Kane might mean business. And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And in the 1v1, Kane makes no mistake. He never really looked like missing, did he? What a goal that is. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Ten minutes to go then. Well, let's see if something comes of this. But they're not being allowed to continue. It's offside. Well, he had the vision to pick out the pass, but he couldn't play it quite quickly enough. And the intervention, a good one by Stones. Marcus Rashford. Well, now he's let that run out of play, and it will be a throw-in here. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. And forward they go, chasing the game. Bellingham Rashford it needs an accurate cross well, a bit short with the clearance well he deserves praise for inventiveness but not troubling the keeper Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Laporte. And back to Unai Simon. And there goes the final whistle. England have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserving champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing.
And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate. The trophy about to be presented. The European champions, England! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. Doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now. PlayStation.